Here we are at the famous and dangerous in one of the most challenging airports in the world, uh, Bugalaga in Indonesia. So I'm flying in now on a Cessna 172 and it has a, the actual airstrip is an incline. Let's see how I do here. All right. Oh, let me get back on the runway here. Oh no. Oh, complete rookie mistake. I need to get over that hill so I have a chance to turn around and, and take off again. Let me give it more throttle. Come on, you can do it. Go, go. Ah, oh, man, what am I gonna do? Okay, maybe, maybe I make the mixture a little rich. Let's give it some throttle. Ah, oh, it's not going. Come on, you can do it. My, okay, parking brake is not set. <laughs> By habit, sometimes I do. So let's make this thing a little bit leaner as far as the uh, fuel mixture and see if that makes a difference since we're at some little bit of elevation. All right, let's more throttle. Nothing. Crap. How am I going to get up there? I may be stuck. I may not have enough runway. Oh well. Let's shut it down. Let's see what we're up against here. Let's uh, take a look outside. Yeah, most planes land and they make it up up this hill because, as you can see, up here you can, there's room to turn around and you know either park or get ready to take off again. And you, from what I understand, you take off and you go down the hill, get a, get some speed, and take off at the edge of the cliff and get airborne, but I don't know if there's enough runway if I were to turn the plane around right here. So uh, let's let's see. Yeah, it doesn't look like we're going to have enough. Hmm. Definitely a rookie mistake. And it is my first time ever at this uh, airport or airstrip, Not definitely not airport by any means. Uh, yeah, here's the edge. It's right up right at the end or the beginning I guess it's both the end and the beginning of the airstrip there's trees and then it drops off into the jungle let's try this again it is a simulator after all so we can always restart all right so here's my second approach attempt let's see how we fare I just got to make sure I keep up my enough airspeed and then once we touch down enough ground speed to carry us over that hill but I don't want to go too fast because <laughs> it'll probably launch me right back up in the air again so let's see okay we're lined up uh oh hang on straighten up here okay all right keeping the throttle up a little bit Let's cut the throttle now. Oh, let's start hitting the bricks. Nice. I finally did it. Sweet. Okay, this I'm gonna just turn this thing around and uh, yeah, why don't we take off again? What the heck? There's nothing to do here anyway. Let's go. I'm gonna call this my Bugalaga touch and go. <laughs> All right, Let's see if we can get enough ground speed. V1, rotate. All right. Hey, that was fun. Actually, that's a nice little challenging airport. Look at that. Tell you what, let's let's swing back around and do this again. See if I can find it again. It's kind of hard to see from a distance.
There it is. I think. Is that it? Yeah. All right. All right, come on. Come on. All right, I <laughs> try and get this thing lined up. Here we go. Oh, not quite. Uh oh, we're getting close. Watch out for those trees. Yikes. Okay. I gotta remember to keep speed up. Okay. More throttle. Oh! Not rudder, throttle. Alright. King of the hill again. This was fun. So if you're enjoying this video and, and my other videos, uh, stay tuned. I, I, I do quite a few videos, mainly in this, the Cessna Citation Longitude uh, business jet. But on occasion, I'll jump into a Cessna or maybe the 747, which I've done a couple of videos on. So please hit the subscribe button and also the little bell icon if you want to be notified of uh, when my new videos come out. So thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.